Yo, what's going on YouTube? It's Castle Scope back in another video. In today's video, I'm gonna show you guys just a quick tutorial, and this is gonna be how to save your camera raw settings, all right? And this is real quick and real easy. Also, before I get into that, I just wanna say that this file, this PSD with all the layers, you see all the layers, all the folders, and the file uh, yesterday from the Alex Caruso speed art, that's gonna be on Gumroad. My link is gonna be in the description. I'm gonna start uploading more of my PSDs on Gumroad. That's an easy way to support your boy and also learn a lot from me. So when you wanna save your camera raw settings, just have your final image or whatever it may be. I'm just gonna press Control Alt Shift E to make a new layer. And I already had had a camera raw, but I'm just gonna do a new one. So go to filter, camera raw filter, right? So boom, now we're in that. And I'm just going to make a couple adjustments to this one. And also, if I have a lisp, it's because I just got back from a filling. So please don't flame me in the comments. All right. So I'm putting my sharpening up. I don't know. I'm just messing around. I'm not really doing anything in particular. I'm just messing around just to show for demo purposes. All right. So say you like it like that or whatever. I don't even know. Like that's green and shit. Oh, ew. All right. But say you like that. So you go to these three lifts right here, right? This took me a year and a half to find out, but shout out to Noah for letting me notice and um, finally figuring this out. So go to these three ellipse, boom. Then all you gotta do is go to save settings right here. Subset is fine, just keep it on default. What you had, go to save. And the very important thing is make sure you save it somewhere you know you're gonna get it. So I have a folder and I have, I have individual folders. Stay very organized, all right? So this is gonna be like, Griffin test too, because I had tested it before just to make sure I wasn't messing up there in the video. So Blake Griffin Nets test two or whatever. Save it as something that you just know what it's going to be. All right. And then press OK. So boom, you have that. And then just for the purposes of the video, I'm going to add it on to uh, just this. I'm going to I'm going to merge this again from visible. I'm going to merge again from visible. And then you see, we already have this camera raw, but now let's just import it, okay? It's super easy. So go to filter, uh, camera raw again. Then you're just gonna hit the three ellipse again. This time, instead of save settings, go to load settings. Okay. And Blake Griffin, uh, that's test two is what we had. Boom, see, it's right on there. Literally, so simple, just like that. All right, press okay. And there you have your camera raw settings. So that's a quick video for you guys. Like I said, if you guys want to check out this whole PSD, all the lighting, all the good candy, eye candy things, it's going to be on Gumroad along with the Alex Caruso design from yesterday. But that's going to do it for the video, guys. Thank you guys for tuning in. And I hope this helps you in your Photoshop future things because it's definitely something helpful and rendering wise. It just, you don't have to write down all your.